Hi, I'm Darren Robertson, an expat pom, chef and part owner of the Three Blue Ducks in the Sydney beachside suburb of Bronte. It's the perfect location to indulge my passion for surfing and I get out amongst it with my mates at any chance I get. I started my career in London under Michelin starred heavyweight Mark Raffan. Then on to Sydney where I cook for famed chef Tetsuya Wakuda. Slack Attack category now has three delicious recipes. Connie's croquettes, Casey's potato bake and Matt's boneless red wings. Now I need to find out if these recipes can be cooked in large quantities. Only the two most successful will survive the commercial kitchen. Guys, this is the batch up. As you've probably guessed, it's all about big numbers. This is your chance to prove that your home recipe cooks on a commercial scale. Hey guys, welcome to Charcoal Kitchen. This week we're in the Victorian Alpine Resort of Falls Creek. It's my winter home away from the ocean as I swap my surfboard with the good old snowboard. It's dumping with snow, so uh, come on guys, let's get amongst it. We're in one of the most beautiful parts of the world. Everything's like looking at a, a postcard. We're gonna run a competition and take three people with us to the farm. Give people that opportunity to ask the farmer questions is brilliant. We're gonna cook lamb for lunch. Some of the belly, all the flaps, some a leg, a couple of cuts from the shoulder and the neck, and then finally the shank. Do you think that you enjoy a meal more if you know it's been farmed sustainably? Absolutely. When you know exactly where something is from and how it's been treated and what it's been fed, you can't, you can't beat it. My name is Dan Robertson. I'm a co-chef and co-owner of the Three Blue Ducks in Bronte, Sydney. So my cooking background is mainly French-Japanese, super fine dining. For me, grilling is just old-school, kind of honest way of, of cooking. This is Iron Chef America. Chef Robertson. Hello. Some great, great seafood here. Yeah, amazing. So I'm not even going to cook them. They're really beautiful and sweet. I do like a little um, avocado buttermilk, um, roast some sesame, use some yuzu and weeds. And, and, and you only have 20 minutes to do it. I know. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to leave you alone. I'm going to leave you alone. Good luck today. Thank you very much. Hello and welcome to this week's Charcoal Kitchen. Now, I'm super excited about today's episode. I'm going to be showing you barbecue in a whole new light. We're going to be cooking formal. Now, I know formal cooking isn't something we usually associate with barbecue food, but I'm going to show you how easy it is to prepare dishes cooked on the barbecue that are elegant, posh, and a little bit grown up. Perfect for a celebration and dinner parties. 